Today I'm going to show you not only a god mode glitch, but a true infinite ammo glitch. This one lasts all game once activated, it works on both Liberty Falls and Terminus. The best part about this glitch is that if you only want unlimited ammo, you can do that. If you want only god mode, you can do that as well. Or if you want both, choice is yours. Before I show you exactly how to set this up, this works both in solo and in co-op with multiple players. The first thing you want to do is create a gobblegum pack with idolize and free fire. This glitch works with any gobblegum that has a timer duration like the ones you see on screen. If you're low on these specific gobblegums or you don't have any, I'll have a link to a tutorial in the description that will show you how to get them fast. Then, load into the map of your choosing and make your way to the gobblegum machine. You can use it for free at the start of every round. In my case, the first gum I got was free fire. Once activated, this one will give me unlimited ammo. Step number two, go ahead and activate your gobblegum. You will now notice in the bottom right hand corner, the gobblegum will have a white ring around it. This is going to indicate how much time the gobblegum has left. When your gobblegum is just about to expire, you will want to spam the keybind button that activates the gobblegum. In my case on keyboard, it was four. If you time this correctly, you will notice another gobblegum animation appear and in the same bottom right hand corner where the gobblegum was, there is just going to be a white ring. You will know you're pressing the right keybind when you hear an empty sound effect saying the gobblegum is in use. If you're on controller, you want to press right on the d-pad, then press A to activate the gobblegum. At this point, you have activated the glitch successfully, you have unlimited ammo for the full duration of the game. It works with any weapon aside from wonder weapons and the GS-45 when it's pack-a-punched. And my personal favorite weapon to use in this glitch is the Sigma Rocket Launcher. When you aim down the sights and fire, it pretty much becomes an automatic rocket launcher. With this kind of damage output, you can farm incredibly high rounds. Now, I'm going to show you how to activate God Mode. Just like before, go to the Gobblegum machine, spin it and get the Idle Eyes Gobblegum. Activate it and you'll want to wait until the timer expires. Just as it's about to expire, spam the keybind to activate the Gobblegum. If you do this one correctly, you'll notice that your screen is going to have a permanent filter overlay. This glitch works on all consoles, however, on PC, you only have to press one key to activate the gobblegum. If you're on controller, you'll have to press two. This is going to decrease the chances of you successfully activating it, but if you're having a hard time activating the glitch on console, you can plug a keyboard into it and use the keybinds that way. I would highly recommend trying this on the blue rarity gobblegums just because they're easier to get and it will give you a better understanding of the timing. Now, you might ask, is there any way to break this glitch and come out of the god mode? Yes, if you use the vault or the armory on Terminus, it is going to take the idolize away. You will only lose the god mode, but the unlimited ammo will still remain there. Before we wrap the video up, this is how to get three guns. Pull out your knife, climb up the ladder, make sure your knife is still in your hand, jump down, purchase a weapon from a wall buy or the mystery box, voila, three guns. If you enjoy glitches like this and you want to be the first to know right when they come out, make sure you subscribe and turn notifications on.